You don't really know much about Halloween. Welcome to another episode of Sinister, Sinister Snacks. Snacks. Oh, we did it at the same time. <laughs> um, on this very fine episode, I'm we are... I'm your host. All right. I'm Joel. <laughs> Laura. And she's usually driving on, on these, so we're the newly deads. And he's just in, in a hurry. No, We're trying to race the clock because his kids are rolling towards our house. <laughs> Soon enough. We'll be inundated with... Mini adults. Yes. Mini, not mini. Yeah. Anyway, uh, we are revisiting our friends at Porking Good Snacks with We uh, love Porking Good. We have actually turned other people onto them that are now fans as well. We are growing the brand, hopefully for them. And I mean, I, so. I'm sure they're doing a fine doing job on their, on their own. own. But They've we're got trying a marketing to do. department that's doing a fine job. But we're doing yes. some grassroots viral marketing. Yeah, exactly. Uh but after our fine experience with their prior dessert pork rinds, we are back with Apple cinnamon. Apple cinnamon flavored dessert pork rind. And cinnamon chur. Whoa. Yum. So um, I'm going to quickly read through it. So it's the, the delectable, daring, taste bud tantalizing, and mind bendingly unique apple cinnamon dessert flavored pork rinds. Close your eyes and imagine yourself in a tranquil apple orchard with cinnamon spiced clouds and melt in your mouth pork puffs. Floating in the sky. Now open your eyes so you don't look weird. Check out a few of our other signature pork rind flavors, and they've got them all listed. Uh, I do want to try the stupid hot one of these days. That's the only one I haven't bought. Yeah. I bought every single one that is on the market. You want to read? Yeah. Except stupid hot. Yeah. Do you want to read that one? Uh, ready to live on the edge of snacking where sweet meat savory and the impossible become possible? Forget everything that you thought you knew about pork rinds and churros. It's time to take your taste buds on a wild adventure. Get ready for the crunchiest, sweetest, mind, most mind-blowing snack experience of your life with porking goods, cinnamon churro. Whoa, whoa. Yeah, I told you their marketing department is. <laughs> I could, I'd like to write for you, uh, Porking Good. We, we would like to become part of your marketing team so your, please your, their marketing department is going to come after you contact us at contact at the newly deads.com <laughs> you're going to join your you're going to make someone angry why at, at like to join your team. we would yes we would like to collaborate with your team yeah. oh my god these smell so good um i am very yeah, into you. porking good man let me smell that one these these yeah these don't smell as good but oh those smell delightful. All right, which one are we starting with? Uh, let's start with this one, and then we'll go to that one. Okay. All right. Uh, Want to just hand me one? Sure. That'll make it easier. Yeah. Got it? Yep. This looks like... Uh, cinnamon churwo. I can't think of what I'm Oh, it does smell good, though. It smells cinnamony. Cheers before you chew. Cheers before you chew. Part one. Their pork rinds are so fresh tasting. They're like light. They're so porky. They're they're the best pork rinds I've ever had. I mean, one more, please. They really are. This is the cinnamon, the churro one, right? Uh huh. Just making sure. I'm... Right. They're like buttery. They're just so good. I am not a fan normally of pork rinds. I always thought they tasted kind of like cardboard. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> That one's too small. There's a good one. Ooh, thank you. I am so excited for this. This smells like apple pie. It does smell like it's very apple y. Yeah. She has for you too, yes. part two. Mm -hmm. Oh, that one. <laughs> yeah, I bought every single one except the super hot because I'm not a super hot guy. That's not my favorite. <laughs> but, um, another winner. You've made me like pork rinds, Pork King Good. 
Oh my god, these are good. <laughs> Those are so good. I'll have what she's having. All right. I don't even need to like you don't want a second? dilly dally. I'm no, I'm gonna eat that whole bag when we're done. <laughs> Just kidding. I, I do want a second one. Um not as big. Okay, thank you. Okay. We were rating both separate. I'm excited to finally try some uh, salty ones. So um, that's the next batch is all salty ones. So. Yeah. These dessert ones have just been But this, this amazing. Finishes, wraps up the dessert portion of our I thought they program. were going to be, I'm sorry. I thought they were going to be gross because I'm like dessert pork rinds sound horrific. We legit went into this whole process going, we're not going to like these and this yeah. is going to make for good content. And yeah. instead we're like, shut your face. Mind blown. Mm -hmm. We were uh, we were impressed. Yeah, it. we were we were gladly mistaken. I th still think the birthday cake might be my favorite out of the, all of them. The apple one is my favorite so but far. But the apple one is is may may take over. And I liked the butterscotch depending. one. I said I didn't like the butterscotch one because I I've yeah soured on butterscotch in my so, life. So uh, out of ten for the churro, the churro one it's a four just because it's not quite got enough out of ten seasoning on it. Okay, all right for me, mm -hmm. I would give it a six. But and I'm gonna give a ten. But the apple one, I'd probably give a seven. I'm I'm giving it a ten out of ten because I prefer savory for these. I think it is delicious. I don't know that yet because I haven't tried. But just based on my experience with what we've had so far, yep, it's about where I'm ten sitting. out of ten. All right. Well, where can they find us? They can find us at thenewlydeads.com. You can find these guys at this address. I'm gonna put right here, just so you got that too. Uh, hopefully, I didn't do that too fast. So you missed ours, but you know our address. Um, and I'm serious, porking good. Contact at thenewlydeads.com. Let us know. Yeah. Uh, thanks for making your product because it's delicious. Worth and also, thank you guys for watching. And until next time. Quit yakking and let's get back to snacking. All right. Bye. Happy Halloween.